when I got here, she was on the floor. She had ripped a lot of the skin off of her arm from falling. The whole top of this part here, like it was just completely folded over, like down to raw skin. What made you fall? I was coming down the hall to yep. go to the bathroom. I took, uh, took the turn to come into the bathroom. And my shoulder hit the uh, door frame. It was all over. In her haste to get into the bathroom, she made too narrow a turn. You know, she's got a wide load and she got to swing, swing around like the tracks of trailers do it. She hit the door here and then she lost her balance and just rubbed the arm back and it just peeled back like wallpaper. You know, probably something like this here. I'm worried about both of them, actually. They're both in ill health, and neither one sees how bad the other one is. I can't breathe. Ah! I think now, with her falling, they need the clutter gone. I mean, they need to be able to, to walk around and not live in two rooms. The reality is this house is just not safe. She tripped over the hoard that we're actually here to clean up. Oh, I can't breathe. I work with a lot of hoarders around the country, and they always say to themselves, well, I can't fall. I'm good. I'll, I'll grab onto the walls. I'll be safe. I'll be fine. The worst case scenario happened to Peter. The one person he loves and loves him back fell. This is really unfortunate that Peter's wife has taken this fall, but this has been my concern from day one. Where does she fall? The bathroom. Has she fallen before, Peter? Because this is probably uh, the third time. So, Peter, this is what I've been talking about from day one, right? Making sure that we get things in order. I'm angry at the fact that it even happened. It should not have happened. It should not have happened. It's heartbreaking to witness Peter and all of his good intentions being so completely disorganized that he's not able to care for her at the level in which she needs to be cared for. Let me ask you this, with your wife falling today, this motivated you a bit more to get this cleaned I, up? I can't be any more motivated than I am. about 15 dogs and nine cats. I can't open it. I'm horrified. I'm going to have to call somebody to pull you out of there. I don't think I'm a hoarder. 